Welcome to the ICE podcast, supported by the U.S. Soybean Export Council, an initiative to enable the cold chain industry of India to be future ready. Hello listeners, a warm welcome to you to this episode of the ICE podcast on cold chain technology. Today we have with us one of the senior most globally recognized cold chain experts who will speak on the relevance of cold chain in the food preservation challenge. I present to you Mr. Arvind Surange. Mr. Arvind Surange is a fellow of the American Society for Heating, Refrigerating and Air Conditioning Engineers. He is the senior most project consultant in cold chain and allied fields in India. Mr. Arvind Surange is the chairman and managing director of ACR Project Consultants Private Limited, who have recently stepped into their golden jubilee year 50 years of glorious service to the cold chain industry associated with cold chain sector for the past 57 years mr arvind surange has introduced many technological innovations including the first ever concept on green cold chain he is the past president of ishre he is the co-chair of uh, nccd's non-conventional and sustainable cold chain initiatives and committee. He sits on various committees, the technical standards committee developed by the National Horticulture Board and several other committees. He has been a recipient of several national and international awards. My pleasure to present to you Mr. Arvind Suraki. Over to you sir. Hi friends, Namaskar and welcome to the world of cold chain which is like a lifeline for the modern world in India. Well, uh, in India, we see cold chain as a sunrise sector due to its great potential for growth. Rightly so, as India is one of the top ranking countries in production of perishable food, which is nearly 500 million metric tons now. Cold chain to me is a wonderful gift of the food technology, engineering and logistics to the modern society. Well, all foods are perishable, but some are less and some are highly perishable. They have different characteristics and different lifespans. How does cold chain help? Well, cold chain helps preserve quality, enhance life, minimize weight loss and damages and facilitate distribution to the markets. Finally, to reach the consumers. Cold chain has a vast gamut of application, right from milk products and milk, uh, fruits and vegetables, fish, meat and poultry products, add to that ready to eat foods and pharma sector, which is so much talked about in the current COVID scenario. Cold chain is not just one process or technology. It follows different routes for different commodities. Some need chilling and storage, the others need to follow the frozen food route. The cold chain involves temperatures generally ranging from uh, 20 degrees C to minus 40 degrees C while going through a variety of operations and processes. Take an example of the fruit and vegetable sector. The starting point after harvest is the pack house, where the operations may include sorting, cleaning, washing, drying, maybe hot water treatment, or maybe waxing if required. Then grading, packing, pre-cooling, and high RH cold storage before dispatch to the distribution centers or ports for exports. There are some commodities which simply follow a direct cold storage route to a bulk or a multi-commodity store. Some follow controlled atmosphere storage route and some others follow the processing, freezing and storage route. Cold stores play an important role in the cold chain. Similarly, logistics and reefer transport also play a very important link in the cold chain. Well, the process of development of the cold chain is already on stream thanks to the incentives offered by the various government agencies. 
what we really need is to focus on following modern technology, energy efficient and sustainable or green designs while creating the cold chain infrastructure. If you can achieve that, India can certainly hope to become a global food basket. We can also hope that with such a sound development, our cold chain will transform into a value chain which will offer value to the producers, processors, cold storage owners, transporters, distributors, retailers and finally the consumers. Let us hope that our dreams come true. Jai Ho Cold Chain. Thank you all.